Oh, he saw us. Okay, it's on, whether we want it to be or not. Let's get out here. Oh, is he stuck? Oh, look at you there, Yogi. Oh, he's not stuck now. Shit. Ow, oh, he got us. All right, welcome back, everybody, to Icarus. I'm an old guy gaming, and we are starting welcome down, friend. Ice Storm Expedition. Legos unit want access to new territory, but it ain't going to be simple. There's heavy weather, freezing temperatures, and God knows what else over there on the ice. And there's more. And there's more. Group 15's got meteorological tech they want tested up there. But the last storm scattered the drop drones to hell. You need to find them, fix them, set it up somewhere safe, and run a test fire during a storm. Good news is, looks like terraforming threw the region into some kind of storm loop. I told you this one was wild. Check your map for markers, then do what you gotta do. All right, so we are still in the forest. I, I know nothing about this mission. Haven't done it on multiplayer. Haven't watched anybody else do it. It's brand new. In fact, every the only other mission that I pretty much know about is the one we're currently working on in multiplayer, which is the stockpile one. Uh, so everything is just brand spanking new to me moving forward. So let's get... Oh, we're way over here. Interesting. Okay. Way over here. So I actually came over here during Argo... Uh, Argos expedition just kind of explored over here, but I didn't do much other than just come over here All right, so and I guess the arctic biome is gonna be uh, This south passage if I remember right we got the lake there So I guess what we do is we build in the forest to gear up and then go into the arctic so I, I didn't know if it was like going to drop us right in the Arctic zone or not, but apparently it doesn't, which probably makes sense because I don't know if we could <laughs> even survive that right from the get-go. Um, okay, well, here, I should actually be starting to gather stuff while I'm yapping here. So let's go kind of assess the situation in terms of, you know, where we want to set the base up, which is a no-brainer. We're going to set it up near the lake because it's beautiful near the lake. A and B, we have access to the fish for the best food and all that kind of thing. Um, but how far in here do we go before it actually gets into Arctic? Oh, wow, it does get... I remember coming through here before. There's a long corridor here. Hmm. Um... Oh. Oh. These are the spots we have to go to. Really? Oh, I can't remember if there's water in here or not. If there is, we might as well set up shop there. Here, let's get uh, some stuff made here. So uh, we need a little bit more stone so we can make the pick. That's the first thing we always need to make. I'm not going to live in a cave this time. We're, we're going to just either live in a rock or build the, the shelter, a wood shelter, and upgrade it because... That was just too much of a pain in the ass, man. Okay, so let's craft this. And we have enough left over to craft this. And then let's craft this. And we'll move this over to here. That can stay there for now. Actually, no, put that in five because that's where I'm used to it. I put my two guns in three and four. Um, what else can we make right at the moment? We need to make some stone arrows, so we need stone. So let's grab a little bit of stone just so we, you know, have some stuff on us here. Probably end up killing that deer so we can get the, the bones for bone arrows and that and the bone knife. I just don't want to go rushing over there without anything at all on us. Okay, so let's go here. Uh, wait. Max 23. Yeah, that's that's probably all we're going to need of those because then we'll just, like I said, uh, craft uh, the bone arrows. Uh, okay, so uh, let's also get the armor made. And that's just going to be a bunch of fiber, so get that done next. 
I just realized something. It's nighttime. They drop me off at nighttime. What the hell? All right, we're gonna have to make a torch, and we'll put it on our our belt loop, uh, so we can see what the hell we're doing. Because I'm not set up yet to make a bed. We got we got to hunt before we can do that. So where did it? Oh, here it is. Okay. All right. So we got that done. Um, what what else do I need for armor? I need legs, arms, and feet. So, uh, legs, arms, uh, need more fiber. Okay, let me get some more fiber here. Okay, so we're fully armored. We get the 5% speed buff. Uh, on that, uh, we need to get some oxide into our little slot too. So let's do that next since we have some over here. There is a cave here, but again, not interested in living in there. <coughs> the worms respawn, you have to deal with the pneumonia, you get the cave debuff, it's just not worth it. Alright, we'll stick all that in there. Um, let's grab another pile of it too. Okay. Let's take a drink from the stream here. Hopefully we don't get a parasite. Uh, we need some food, so we'll start with berries. Just got to find some here. Uh, did I actually loot some? I did. Okay. Uh, let's just eat that whole stack of berries. Can we eat soybeans straight up? No, we can't. Okay. We'll hang on to that other stuff for now. Um... Uh, okay. I think we're ready to proceed. Let's, uh... Let's see if we can do a little bit of hunting, too. Okay. Sorry, baby deer. But, uh... I need your stuff. We are in a survival situation here. <laughs> uh, what? Oh, I picked it up. That's what I did. I'm going, where did it go? So we'll get enough, uh... Hunt enough, you know, to get the fur and stuff. Uh, we should. We need to cook the meat so we have food too. All right. Does that give us enough bone to make a bone kniffy? It does not, because we need a little wood. Oh shit! All right, come here. Yeah, we need use too, actually. So as usual, guys, I will keep you with me uh, for the entire uh, first episode here. Did I not make? An axe? I don't think I did. Okay, can I make an axe? Yes, I can. We have to get some wood. Man, I'll tell you what, having having this torch uh, on your tool belt is just amazing. It, it's just, it's like, why why didn't they add that to the game, like, from the get-go? <laughs> they just probably didn't think about it, because um, a lot of these updates that they came out with in the recent um, Week 11 update was player-requested updates. So... And by the way, I'm not worried about grinding XP. We're like level 50 something or other, 53. Um, you know, we have all of the blueprints that we need to get started. So leveling from here on out is just going to happen naturally. I'm not going to go out of my way strictly just to level. Unless, you know, we're waiting on something and I need to kill some polar bears or something. Uh, okay, so since we... Oh, speaking of bears, shit. Um, since we have some meat. Let's go ahead and make a campfire. Uh, I'm going to need a little bit more stone here. And we'll cook this meat. And you know what? If we found a large enough... That's not a cave, is it? No. If we found a large enough boulder, we could probably get a bedroll inside of it and sleep the night. That's making me a little nervous, i gotta, got to admit. Or we could... No, you know what? We could sleep in a cave. Well, not until we make a bedroll, though. <laughs> That's right, I'm getting ahead of myself. Getting ahead of myself. I don't really want to try and kill a bear with a basic bow and stone arrows. Not my idea of a fun time. Okay, let's make this. And uh, we will cook 
that. Yeah, it sounds like we got a wolf around. Yep. Come here, dude. I need your giblets. Come at me, bro. Uh, we should make some bandages too, by the way. And I don't know why I am carrying around this baby deer. Uh, nope. G. Drop. And the kniff broke. Okay, so grab all of that. Oh, geez, that bear's close. I still don't have enough for a bedroll. How many arrows do I have? 24. I mean, yeah, we could probably kill the bear as long as he's not super high level. I'm not going to deliberately engage him, though. Uh, let's get some cooked meat immediately down here, because that'll also give us health. Uh, but we, we need to eat it, too, for the buff. Okay, while we're waiting for that, um, let's make a suture kit in case that bear nails us. And we'll put that in nine, and then uh, we'll make a few bandages, too. What is this? Minor showers. Okay, I'm not super worried about that. It is going to make our campfire go out, though, but we'll do the best we can here. Enjoy the struggle in the early game. Can I make a bone arrow? Oh, I can't. How many can I make? 13. Okay. Much, much better than stone arrows if we have to engage this bear. So let's switch to the bone arrows. He might leave us alone. He's kind of hanging out over there. All right, well, so much for the campfire business. Um, I'm going to pick this up and take it with us. And let's move away from Mr. Bear here. Okay, so we have to get into this next valley. And I'm hoping there's a lake over here. That would be ideal. Let's pick a few more resources while we're running. I need. Oh, there's a wolf. A, a wolf and a pig. Alright. That pig. Can we do this? Okay. I hear another pig, though. Oh, there he is. Got him. Whew. Okay. I feel so inadequate <laughs> with these stone weapons at the moment. Whew. We're doing okay though so far. Um, say so let's get the wolf and the other pig. I have noticed in the forest biome that um, we're gonna pick these and put them on the fire when the rain's over. I have noticed in the forest bomb that when you kind of get to the extreme ends of it, uh, there's more danger. seems to be more dangerous animals. Where the hell did that wolf go? Oh, here he is. Okay, I'm going to destroy these and get the mats back. And let's make... Uh, well, actually, I want to make the bone knife first. Let's craft that. And then we'll make some more uh, bone arrows. Okay. And we'll put the bone knife there. We'll destroy this for the mats. And put the meat down here. And okay. We're not doing too bad. Not doing too bad. We'll pick some more pumpkins. Um, I don't know if we're going to totally escape the exposure damage before it chills, but it's going to be close enough to where I'm honestly not too worried about it. Alright, let's get this out. Oh, crap, another bear. Uh, is that a bear or a buffalo? 
I don't know. I feel just slightly more confident taking on a bear if it's not super, super high level. Now that we have bone arrows. But we don't really want to do that with storm exposure because it's going to jack with our stamina regen and all that. Um, is there a sizable enough rock that I can duck into? Let's go back over here. Probably this one. Yeah, alright. Let's do it. Almost not worth it, really. Yeah, you know what? It's not worth it. Screw it. Let's just wait. By the time the exposure maxes out, the worst part of the storm will be over. We might take a couple of hit points, but not a big deal. One thing we could do, though, actually, is hollow this out and get the campfire inside so we can keep cooking some more stuff. Uh, do I have enough stuff to make a bedroll? Oh, I do. All right. Let's craft that. Nice. All right. Can you... It doesn't look like... <coughs> it can fit, so let's dig out a little bit more here. Um, actually, I'm going to cook the pumpkin first. Um, so it doesn't go bad, and then we'll cook the meat afterwards. Alright, what time is it? It's 2300, so... This might be big enough for me to get this, the bag inside of. We'd have to move the fire, of course. In fact, let's do that now, because it's not raining anymore. We'll just put the fire right there. Okay, let's uh, carve out a little bit more of this and see if we can get the bedroll inside of it. The torch makes nighttime bearable, but in terms of scene, but I'd still rather it not be night. It doesn't have to be. All right, can we get this in here? Um, still says it's colliding. Okay, so that could be... I don't see anything else on the ground, like a little chunk that we might have missed. So it might be the height. Let's try this. Oh, come on. Oh, yep, right there. Perfect. Okay. Uh, let's actually keep it here. And use this as a spawn point temporarily, just in case we do bite the bullet. Um, and I think I'm going to leave the campfire here, too. Okay, so that gives us another buff food. Uh, we'll find some more berries later on. What? Oh, for goodness sakes. We just finished the storm, you stupid game. Alright, well... I think that fire will burn until the first little cloud comes on the gauge, maybe. So if we can get a couple more pieces of meat before that happens, we'll be doing okay. Why don't you just go on my toolbar, man? Alright, while we're waiting for that, let's uh, make another bandage. And I want to make a few more suture kits too, but one's probably okay for now. I've never had a wolf give me a deep wound, but bears can. Alright, well, so much for that. So, I guess we're just going to leave all this here. And uh, let's pro let's go into the, uh, to the valley here. Oh, shit, there's no water in here, you guys. Doggone it. That sucks. No water at all. I guess we could use snow. 
until until we can make the rain thing which actually you know what the rain thing won't take that long to make okay yeah we're fine the only downside to that is we're gonna have to travel to the lake to go fishing when we want to make the really good food but I mean if that's what we got to do that's what we got to do it's not the end of the world okay so let's take him out and him out uh, let's not get too many down or I'm gonna forget where they all are got the arrow back that's nice um what why aren't you letting me skin what the hell we got the knife in our hand it's not letting me skin him oh well hello you cantankerous thing can we skin him? Yeah. So why can't we skin the buffalo? Alright, let's go back to our boulder and remove this storm exposure. Alright, while we're waiting, is there anything we can craft? Uh, more bone arrows, I guess. Oh, I wanted to do a couple more suture kits. We're going to need some fiber. So let's go pick up a little more fiber. Can I make the sickle? Uh, what do we need for that? We need just a little bit of wood. Okay, let's grab some wood. We'll make the sickle. And then we can get a, a bunch of fiber. No, not max. Craft. There you go. There you go. Put the wood back in there. And the sickle is... Oh, I put the... Wait, what? Yeah, I think I put the wood back before it was done crafting. Try that again. There we go. Okay. Some, some survival games take the stuff out. At the time you tell it to craft, some wait until the crafting's done before it removes it. I like the first way better, but... Okay, I want to see if I can start the fire now and have it stay started. Looks like it's going to stay started so we can cook up the rest of this meat. Okay, so let's um, buff with this. We'll buff with this. And we'll buff with some berries once I find some. And let's get some more fiber. There's some berries. You can't use the sickle on f berries. Well, you can, but all you get is fiber when you do. It doesn't give you the uh, the berries. Get a headshot on that guy, so you get the crit. All right. Where's our, where's our stone? What the hell? I lost our stone with all of our stuff. Wasn't it over here? Oh, I'm on the wrong side. <laughs> I'm on the wrong side of the canyon. I'm like going, where did it go? Oh my goodness. Can't take me anywhere. Okay. Let's pop that in. We'll grab the cooked meat out of here. And uh, I want to make a couple more of these. How many can I make in total? 11? No, you know what? Let's make nine and we'll have a full stack and be done with it. And uh, I want to make five more of these. And then that'll take care of our bandages. Okay. Let's put uh, you in here. We're going to have to get some more oxide here pretty soon. And... Um... A drink of water. Where's the nearest water? It's back at this creek. So yeah, I better run back there really quick and grab that. I need a crafting bench before I can make the water skin. 
And we need a shelter before we can use the crafting bench, so. Okay, the bear's back over this way. We can kill him as long as he's not um, really high level. Okay, here's the water. Oh, he saw us. Okay, it's on, whether we want it to be or not. Get out here. Oh, is he stuck? Oh, look at you there, Yogi. Oh, he's not stuck now. Shit. Ow, oh, he got us. Okay. Of course, the stupid wolves have to join in too. All right, we got him. The hell out of here, wolf. Put my arrow back. No, no, no. This is my kill, not yours. You're my kill, too, now. All right. Well, we got a, a small bleed effect on that. Could have gone worse. A skinned bar, get some XP, get some good materials. We're going to have to repair this. And we'll get these guys too. And then we'll head over and decide where we're going to actually uh, build our base. And I'm just going to use snow in the campfire for water early on. And then once we get the rain thing set up, you know, then we don't worry about water, at least for drinking. For fishing, I'm probably just going to have to go on little fishing trips to the lake and bring it back and you know we'll be able to make the ice box so we can keep them fresh and that that won't be a too big of a hassle i mean it'll be a bit of a hassle but not a big one okay let's hit enter into this valley and take a look see at what we got here did i grab some berries i think i did didn't i yeah okay let's eat these we get the buff from them Food buffs are very important in this game. Very useful, too. I remember coming into this little valley when we were exploring. I just looked around, though, and didn't stick around, of course. It's too bad there isn't a lake here, though. That would have been made things a lot nicer. But we'll make do. We will make do for sure. So basically, we're going to live just right outside the snow biome. Uh, more or less, that's the plan. And if there's polar bears around here, then uh, that's going to be a plus for XP and all that, you know. But... That could be a polar bear. Or maybe it's just a bear bear. If it is a polar bear, we're not messing with him right now. Hell no. Oh, that scared me. The temperature up here didn't just drop. It went in a free fall. It's a completely different world now. Weather never recovered. It's just one big rolling storm. Legos and Group 15 think their new tech can do something about that. But expect the unexpected, because no one's sure what the hell's happening in the Arctic yet. And that's why you're here. So is he saying it's perpetually storming in this place? No, it looks like the storm is about ready to get over. Uh, I just want to kind of poke my head in a little bit. I thought I heard a bear. Um, let's grab the ice, too, by the way. We can't actually use this until we have a container to put it in. 
Okay, no, so it's not like perpetually storming. Maybe it is at the, you know, the quest site, though. Okay, well, we're not prepared to, to be in here, so let's get the hell back out of here quickly. Um, I guess if polar bears do wander out, we might not want to be right next to the entrance. So, where do we want to be then? Um, probably just kind of back down into the valley here, where it's kind of flattish, I suppose. Um, so we could just build maybe in this general vicinity. Should probably work okay. Uh, let's run up here. I just want to look and see what the what things look like up here. There's another bear. What level is he? can't really tell from here so let's just he's 40 shit run away That's a little intense, man. Not gonna lie, it's a little intense. And looks like our kniffy broke again, so let's repair that. Okay, I just want to take a quick peek up here and see if, how scenic it is. Um, the problem, though, actually. The further away I go this way, the longer it's going to take me to get to the lake. Um, you know, and this seems to indicate one of the spaces we need to go. Let's go there first before I let you guys go, because we gotta we got to wrap up this episode. Um, let's just go see what this first thing of a doodle is. Maybe it's one of those pieces we have to pick up or something. And then um, I'll just figure out... I'll probably build the house right next to the canyon entrance there, just so we're a little closer to the lake. Most likely. All right, where are we at? Oh, you know what? I don't need my torch on anymore. Let's turn that off. Okay, so we need to go up here. Oh, yeah, there we go. Okay. So this is one of the pieces of equipment that we're supposed to gather. Um, oh, okay. The other ones are actually in the Arctic zone. Gotcha. Okay. Well, um, I guess we might as well grab this now. It's one kilogram. Okay. All right, you guys. Well, I'm going to let you go here, and I'm going to do the usual, uh, which basically means I'm going to get a house built. I'm going to start gearing up, and I I might not bring you guys back until we're actually ready uh, to head into the Arctic because everything up until that point is just preparation and stuff you've already seen. Uh, so that's kind of my plan, but if I have a compelling reason to bring you back before then, I shall do so. Otherwise... Thanks, guys, for watching. I hope you enjoyed this episode. And if you did, please hit that like button and subscribe to the channel. Leave a comment and share out the video. And we'll catch you in uh, the next episode. Let's go kill this beer. Uh, beer. Bear. Let's go kill the, kill the bear, not the bear. You guys can leave now. But I'll keep the camera on while I kill the bear for those of you who might want to see it. <laughs> All right. Are you still here? Are you guys still here? Let's uh, craft some more of those. And we should probably repair this too. And we should get this buff going on. All right. Level 48 bear. Man, they're getting bigger and bigger.
We we got him. And now the pig wants to come in. And the wolf. Come here, you bastard. Okay. Where did that bear go? How do you lose a bear that's that big? He's right here. <laughs> All right, you guys need to go now, seriously.